Hey guys, what's up? Ashley here, and this is just going to be a really quick intro. Um, it's day number 194 of daily vlogging, and um, I'm, it's Saturday, and I'm running some errands. And my hair is really gross, and I don't feel like washing it myself, so I came over here to Ulta for them to do it, because I'm lazy. And really, that's the only reason why. <laughs> and it's been a roller coaster of a week, so I deserve it. <laughs> um... Yeah, but I'm running really late, so I'll check back in in a minute. Bye. All right, so I got my hair washed. <laughs> now I don't have to do it myself. Um, so, yay. It's such a project, guys. Like, it really is. I don't know. If you if you don't have, like, long, um, thick, fine hair, <laughs> then you don't understand how, how, um, how annoying washing my hair is. <laughs> Um, like I love taking long showers, but I don't love having to do things while I'm in the shower. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> like I like just standing there. Anyway, so I did. So I got my hair washed at Ulta. Um, it just cost forty bucks, which um, not bad. If you like, I mean, obviously it's not sustainable every week, but you know, every once in a while, just get my hair washed and like. A good scalp massage. <laughs> um, you know, nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that. Um, I mean, I did give her a $10 tip, so I guess it was 50 bucks. But whatever. So then I did some shopping at Ulta because I was out of my hair stuff. Um, so this is my favorite shampoo. It stinks that it's freaking $32 for this little baby bottle. But it is so necessary because it has helped my hair so much since I started using it. And I have the matching conditioner. It's Bumble and Bumble Repair Shampoo. It's so good. It makes my hair feel so, so nice and, and strong and not like straw. Like the quality of my hair has been so good since I started using it. Um, also, I got, I got this um, purple shampoo. I just got the travel size because I actually prefer the purple treatment mask of this brand. Um, not the shampoo. So, because it has the same pigment color as the shampoo, but it's a conditioner, so it's, like, it's better <laughs> for my hair. Um, but I did, so I just got, um, the, the shampoo a small size, so then, because they didn't have the treatment one, so I'll order that online and buy that and pick it up. So I just got this, so I have the purple in the meantime. Um, but yeah, and then I picked up some stuff for Quart also, but... Yeah, so that was my Ulta experience. Now we're off to the next stop. Um, I have to go buy some toilet paper and fabric softener at Target and some pants because I've been very, I've been very open and honest that my pants aren't fitting. So <laughs> let's see what I can get at Target. I'm in Target and they're totally out of the large packages of Scott toilet paper. They only have the 12 pack and we usually get the like 100 pack. <laughs> 100 is, is too much. I'm exaggerating. I'm not really sure how many are in the bigger package, but we usually get the big package. So I picked up two because a 12 pack isn't enough. <laughs> I mean, like, come on, we need our toilet paper. Like, why is there, why is there no Scots? I don't understand. Is there a new, sh is there a new toilet paper shortage that I'm unaware of? I don't know. Now I get some fabric softener. Oh, and I found three pairs of jeans, so good. <laughs> oh, sheesh, is it hot out? <laughs> oh my God. And, okay, so I was at Target and I got a, I was looking for a shelf for my room to like put all my minis on and like my all my ears and stuff um, I just needed more shelving in my room <laughs> so I found a shelf in Target and I was like okay good I'm gonna buy this so I paid for all my other things first got a, five, a $10 gift card from like just random things that you buy at Target you know you get it's like oh spend buy two of these things and get a $5 gift card so I had two two things like that so I got $10 and I used it towards my shelf so I came back out and then I went back in and got the shelf. Holy mackerel, it was so heavy. <laughs> First, I couldn't get it off the shelf because I, well, I could barely reach and it was very heavy. So some, 
So someone uh, took pity on me and came and helped me. Thank you, random woman in Target who uh, saved the day for me because I probably would have broke something. <laughs> um, so then she helped me get it off the shelf. I didn't really think about how I'm getting this in my car. Oh man, it took me like 10 minutes <laughs> to get it out of the cart and into my trunk. I should have like set up my camera so we could see m me struggling and that would have been really funny. Um, but also there was someone sitting in the car right next to me watching me struggle. Like, thanks for offering to help, dude. <laughs> but, but I am very proud of myself that I did it all by myself. But when I get home, Kat's gonna have to help me because there's no way I can carry it up the stairs alone. <laughs> <laughs> it's a struggle just getting it in the trunk. Um, so now I am going to go to the movie theater and buy some popcorn per the request of Court and Cat, and then I'm going to be heading home. So I'll probably show you my shelf construction another day. <laughs> um, so yeah, I got to cool off, man. I am roasting. It is so hot outside. Ugh. Um, so yeah, that's it for, for me for today. Um, thanks for coming along with me on my errands. <laughs> Not really errands, but whatever. Um, and that's it. All right, guys. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Love you. Bye. I hate when I say bye and then I have more things to say. <laughs> Oops. But, so I just came over to Sinmark, right back there. And uh, because Court and Cat said, oh, they have to-go bags of popcorn. So you should go get us some popcorn, uh, kettle corn, so when we watch Black Widow tonight, we can have popcorn. So I went in and I said, hey, I heard you have giant, I have, well, <laughs> I heard you have to-go bags of popcorn. And they said, yeah, this is the to-go bag of popcorn. Look how giant it is. Like, it's bigger than my face. Like, look at this! <laughs> what? Like, we'll never finish that in a million years, ever. Um.